man accused of firing a single round into a local TV station this month before barricading himself inside a restaurant was set to face a judge this morning. But Jarrett Nathan was not in court today. A second mental evaluation was ordered. WREG's Jarita Patterson spoke with his sister, who says although she wishes this never happened, she is grateful it has sparked conversation regarding mental health. All rise. The family of Jared Nathan sat looking straight ahead in court, hoping to lock eyes with a man who has been in lockup since being arrested earlier this month. I haven't seen him. His family will have to wait as Nathan was not in court. Two weeks ago, the judge ordered a mental evaluation with more testing still to be done. The mental evaluation has uh, come back. They are needing to send him to MMHI. Which is the Memphis Mental Health Institute. It is unclear why another test was ordered. For the family, they say it is yet another part of an emotional roller coaster they hope will soon end. My eyes are just now going down. I bet my eyes been swollen. I can't I can't eat or sleep thinking about my baby because that's my baby. Dang, her tears do not compare to her brother's cry for help after he was shot seven times last June. Jerry lost everything. Jerry, he was an uh, entrepreneur. Jerry had two houses. He was selling cars, you know, but the streets don't love nobody. All the more reason why Marnesha Nathan said she had to be here. He probably feel like he don't got nobody in his corner. Even more emotion was on display as Nathan's family embraced outside the courtroom before using our camera to deliver a message to the man they have not seen or heard from. You see this, baby? Please hold on. Please hold on. It is just through those doors where Nathan's family was speaking with his public defender. They are telling us it is the not knowing that has been the most difficult. But what we do know is that second evaluation has been requested through the Memphis Mental Health Institute, an assessment that could bring with it some answers for a family that has plenty of questions. Pray for him, for his mental health. In Memphis, Jarita Patterson, WREG, News Channel 3. And Nathan, who has been charged with aggravated assault and reckless endangerment with a deadly weapon, is set to appear in court June 21st.